We're gonna show us how to create a, let's see if I can get it. There it is, thank you. Just Dis kick and display for Karate Balance's page. Everybody's having fun with it, why can't I? It's so much fun, yeah. and it's especially fun for our viewer, Kimberly Donovan. We love yeah. when we get your, your letters to our mailbox wall, and love when you give us ideas of what to do. And this was such a perfect idea for your son and yeah. daughter. Remind everybody what the, the letter was about. Kimberly wanted to create a place to hang yeah. their karate belts. Um, All right. Well, Kimberly's joining us. I think I, I just Yay. saw her pop up. Hi, Kim Kimberly. Nice to see you. Welcome. Yay. Hi. Joining us from Hi, North guys. North Carolina. Yes. Tell us about your children's belts. <laughs> um, Dominic and Bella have recently earned their yellow belt in Shotokan karate. Oh. So I'm really excited. There they Ooh. are. They're I'm excited so for this journey that they're on together. Dominic's 19 and Bella is almost 12. She'll be 12 this month. Oh. I feel like that is such a good older brother. Yeah. Like, yes, taking care is. of his little sister. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that just warms my yes. heart. My brother and I are eight years <laughs> apart. And so anytime I could help him, I used to love doing it. So this, uh, it really means a lot to me to even make this, you know, for inspired by your children. We actually have Dominic and Bella's belt here. Yes, we do. Today. Yes. That you oh. sent. Thank you so very much. Ooh, there's the white and, and there's the, the yellow. yellow. This is the new one. Perfect. Paige, what did you do with them? Well, I thought this is a great way to display the belts that they mm -hmm. currently have and give them sort of something to look forward to as they continue continue their journey uh, with the belts going right on up all the way to black. All right. Well, let's take a look at if you're okay. getting busy earlier. I got started earlier today. Um, and all you need here, you do not need the, the board down below. I was just kind of shoring it up. But what you need here uh, is one by threes that are equally spaced apart. You can just pick little pieces of wood. I had scrap wood that I picked. It was about a half inch, like quarter inch to a half inch apart. And then this is a one by six. You can see I'm just sanding down the edges. I was using oak, and so it's a really hard wood. Mm, um, it is hard, yeah. And it's so beautiful too, but I did paint the back. The rest I wanted to leave natural because it's so gorgeous. Um, right now, I am just putting a little bit of glue. This glue will hold it together, but of course I'm gonna go a step further and nail it into place. I'm making sure, we're looking at the back right now, and I'm making sure that it is even on both sides. And then I took my nail gun, went all the way down. You could also use screws if you don't have a nail gun. And then because um, I saw that picture of Dominic and Bella, I wanted a little place up on top to display their pictures or their medals or whatever they have. And at the hardware store, you can pick up this little molding piece that makes it look like you whittled it out of wood yourself. Um, it's such a quick and easy way and an expensive way to make it look so fancy. Mm. And it was really so easy to do. You could really just completely glue it together. Let me check in with Kimberly. You're, you're with us so far, right? Yes. Okay, so, because we're not finished yet, because I still, at first, when I saw this, I was like, wait, where's she going with this? How are we gonna hang this? So, yes. for, quick question, just glue, nail, and glue, screws? You could, um, you could screw, you could nail, but what, uh, you could really just use the wood glue and leave mm -hmm. it 24 to 48 hours. If okay. you have that kind of time, I didn't. I was so excited, I had to get it up, so. Did you stain? I did not. What did you I, do? So I would beautiful. say, if you guys are doing this at home and you pick um, an inexpensive wood like pine, I yeah. would say you'd stain it to kind sure. of match what you have going on at home. But because I used oak, I just used a little beeswax on top. And okay. I'll ask you to mind your own beeswax. <laughs> uh, that was my mom's joke, actually. <laughs> Thank you, Kimberly, for laughing. Um, so I just put a little beeswax over the top to bring out that golden oak color, well, which I love. Will she, Kimberly, need to apply beeswax to keep maintain it, no. or is it so it's once it's done, go. it's good to go? It's okay. good to go. So then, how do Great. we attach the belt to this? Yes. Is what I was. Well, I wanted to celebrate the fact that they've gotten to this stage and mm. then also give them a chart to kind of look up to um, sure. in the beginning. So I want to show you that picture of what it looks like when all the belts are up there. You can see where it starts with white at the bottom, mm. goes all the way up to the black belt. But let's say you want to use those belts again. Oh. You don't have to put them in a case and lock them away. This allows you to use them. So I'll show you how I did it. So I took this. This is called braided elastic here. This is 3 8 inch. They sell it in all sorts of uh, shapes and sizes. Mm -hmm. Yep. And and then I just cut a little bit, it's kind of like a hair tie. You just cut a little piece of the elastic mm -hmm. and tie it around. So I'm gonna do it on this last piece here. And because it's already hung up on the wall, I'm going to do this in the front. You'll notice it'll look a little bit different, but it's easy to move around. And Kimberly, I know you know this. 
It's like a hair tie. Yeah. You can just move it That's all right. the way around. And then after you do that, do you cut the, the tail yep. off of it? You there trim you the tails. Thank okay. you so much. Sure. I'm going to trim that. Okay. And that thank you. And just put this all the way around. Hide that in the back. And that becomes our holder. So now, how do we you. do this? No, well, we do okay. the white first. We start with well, white on the okay, bottom. So we're going to do the. I'm going second. second. Okay. Because they are at the yellow stage right now. Okay. So you just tuck them in. What are you thinking so far, Kimberly? I love it. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, and um, it's I would like to know what this means here. These are your belts. What's yeah. with the stripes? Yes. Yeah, what's with the stripes? Um, they needed to earn so many stripes in order to get to their next belt in the Shotokan. How fun. Oh, nice. All right. Yeah. Okay. By the way, did you ever watch the movie Karate Kid? Have your kids seen Karate Kid? Of course. Nice. <laughs> it's so much fun. I, I know. It's so much fun. <laughs> and yeah. um, We're going to top it off, right? A special way. Dominic and yeah. Bella, look at them in their yellow belts with their certificates. We're going to put this reminder right on top of this little shelf that we got. Yes. Oh, so, I love it. <laughs>